Oh, Ain't no way you tested this thing out in here. And now I'm putting this here. He's going to eat the pizza. <laughs> What's happening, y'all? Welcome back to what did you say? Thumbnail. Sorry. <laughs> Get out of here. What is happening, everybody? Welcome to Life on Promise You, the channel where my wife and I take this lovely 20 acre property that the Lord has blessed us with and make it into a home and also a blessing for others. Today, we have our, or not have, but we are getting ready for the big old snowstorm coming through. It's gonna drop a whole bunch of crap off on us, so. We got to go ahead and get this place ready. Our How exactly? Night. Yeah, our, our first, our <laughs> first winter storm, major winter storm. Yeah. Winter in general, <laughs> as homeowners, everything here is the first for us. But the first thing we got to do is get the cars into the garage. It's supposed to be super cold. Get the cars in to have some protection. I don't think. Let's flip it around. I don't think that's gonna fit in there, but. I heard a little car wheel, so the first thing we gotta do is clear all this crap up out of there. We're gonna grab these, run them on down here to the burn pile, and burn them up real quick. We just gonna throw it into the truck and drive it over there. I ain't walking all the way over there with all this stuff. And after we do that, we gotta go over where that little thing at. Then we gotta move that into the shed over there. It's been sitting out there for like two months we have a lot of things to do so we also have to i have my list unhook the hose um he said already put the mower away we need to fill up our gas containers get some shovels we need to get some margarita mix oh my gosh <laughs> we need to put like just gas our cars up just in case get some water um maybe some sleds and also get some salt too and put the um the paddle boat in the shed i ain't even moving that, that shed, paddle boat <laughs> even though that shed is barely uh good it, it, it's just not good it's raggedy it's but falling we apart need to put it up for the winter so yeah we have a lot to do today All right, we're loaded up on our way to the burn pile. I'm a little bit under the weather. Sickness is going around. <laughs> <laughs> so sorry for my sniffles. <laughs> it does look nasty. Got my turtleneck on. Let's do an outfit of the day. Got my turtleneck on um, because it's cold. Headband from probably TJ Maxx. My gloves, my coat, and these cute boots. These are Sorel. These are my um, my designated snow boots. So I'm prepared for the upcoming weather. Who is coming? Sounds like someone is coming. Yes, FedEx. They are going very fast here. To get closer, I'm sorry. Get on my nerves. Why are you 10 million yards away? I didn't want it to get burned. Oh, that feels great. 
What is it about fire that's so fun to watch? Well, that's pretty much all burnt up. Now we gotta go move this little John Deere boy into the shade. I'll try to anyway, see if we can get it to start. If not, try to push it or something. He just tried to start it, but it's not starting. And I don't know how we're gonna get it here because it's super heavy, can't really push it. We tried before. So, you might just have to stay there all winter. We'll see. All right, done with that. Next thing we're gonna do is fill up on our gas so that tomorrow when the snow comes and we need to pave our way out, we can make sure that the tractor is filled up on gas, so gonna make a quick gas run and then we'll be back to try to get that thing into the shed where do we gotta go first Lowe's the grocery store no, we're not going to the grocery store until later we're going to Costco we don't have Costco card so we need to meet up with my mom later so, so I guess we're going to Costco and then Lowe's and stuff maybe well, what do we have to get from Lowe's I forgot already well I need a shovel Shovel and salt. No, no shovel, salt, and... Shovel, uh, salt, sleds. Oh yeah, sleds. I'll show you on the hill when we get back. Where we gonna sled down. She said we can't sled out there, but we can sled out there. It's not a good it's hill. It's a hill to sled out there. I feel like it's not steep it. enough, but we'll see. It's a hill to sled out there. It'll be Like any good errands run, gotta stop at Starbucks. All right, pit stop done. We've made it to our second home, honestly. Since we bought this house, we've been here 511 times, literally at least once a week. We give them all of our money, but we're here. I'm gonna get our list and get to shopping. Yep. Walk right in and found our first item. We need some salt, so I'm gonna get a few of these. What kind is this? Winter. Huh. Anyway. Take those things off your feet. Oh. I'm not. Yeah. Why am I always looking out? She be hating on my shoe game. Man. Ain't nobody doing it like this. Nobody. Ah. We finna crash. That's why she's not allowed to drive. Let me see which one I want. I need that one that's ergonomical. That is not what you need. <laughs> <laughs> It's a car shovel. Oh, this $12 one should work. Uh, get the one with the little blade on the edge of it. $17. Unless you want to get a big one for when you got to do the driveway. You know hey, no way play. you tested this thing out in here. Come on. <laughs> I am. Take this. <laughs> All right. Now. Let's look at our list. Because we still have a few more things to get. Yeah. We do need some, like, for real gloves. I don't have any. He got these. Firm grip. You know, everybody wanted the socks. Everybody. I, I got me some socks just like that on my feet right now. Oh. I folded them down, but these are good. We don't need those socks. We don't need those kids. <laughs> yeah, put them back. This is the creepiest Santa of my life. <laughs> Bro, why is the mouth so big? <laughs> All right. She don't know how to work the little gun. Yeah. Dang. <laughs> that real quick. 
came out to $61. Look at this, 61 bucks. We got two bags of salt, some gloves, and a shovel. Thanks, Obama. Gas? No, uh, uh. <sighs> okay. Alright. We're going to Walmart first. I gotta taste this glove out. <laughs> We're gonna go to Walmart. It looks like they're gonna get when they get wet, they're not gonna be good. Like from the snow. Uh I think they'll be fine. Bad choice. I think they'll be fine. We ain't using them to play in the snow. Just a shovel. I like the way Are they, they feel. They fuzzy? Warm. Fuzzy soft, inside? They're warm. But we're going to Walmart so we can get these slits. I'm going to drive with these. <laughs> <laughs> going to Walmart so we can get the slits. And then, yeah. And then home? Oh, no. Then we're going to get gas after that. Yep. Nice. Right. She love testing stuff out. For well, how many? Just one? Just $30. Two? Yeah. $30? One. $30 for this. One. Apparently, we got to get cookies and yeah. some water, too. Cookies so. and water. And then we're done and going to go back home for a little bit before Costco. We don't need no cookies. We gonna eat the cookies up. <laughs> Made it to the gas station. Here's a diesel. Found one. Bingo. All right, we got our stuff. We got our sled. We got our gas. Oh, we're gonna unload real quick, and then we're going to get the important stuff. We're gonna go around quick, make sure all the hoses. Hoses? Hose? Hoses? All the hose. All the hose. <laughs> <laughs> make sure they all undone. I think we just have two. That one and then the one around the corner. Coyotes coming out here. That's gonna look real cool out here with the snow. Ah! What is happening? I fell. See how this is why, we, this why we can't take her nowhere. <laughs> oh, I already got that one too. Okay. All right. Oh, I'm like, what the heck is that? I'm gonna sit right out here and watch the snow tomorrow. So it turns out that <laughs> the paddle boat is has water frozen in it. We waited too late, as you can see here. It's all frozen solid. So the least that I want to do is just put it up on this tree here rest it against the tree we'll see these things are frozen in there I wasn't gonna do it anyway okay well that's done not done to the extent of what I would have hoped but good enough now we just gotta wait to go to Costco are we doing the mower oh we can try so here all that wood over there we do need a little stick camera Remember I have one. Where? The little thing. <laughs> this is fun. <laughs> Why are you acting like this is new? I never did it before, alright? Why do you think it's new? Alright, let's try this. Take that. Try to start it again real quick. Quick tractor ride.
mess it up. And now I'm putting this here is off. Are you pushing all the way down? No, I'm not pushing at all. I forgot. <laughs> I forgot. Well, how are we going? Okay, so that uh, diesel gas can is too big and too high for me to be able to turn it down and pour it into the fuel tank. So I'm gonna pour it into this smaller one first. It actually has a flexible knob on it so I can get down there and actually pour it in instead of trying to <laughs> waterfall that mug. I had to step inside because it was getting so cold, but looks like he got it gassed up and is putting it back. I need to pull in my car now that the garage is clean and we got those boxes and whatnot out of the way. So that's what I'm gonna do next. So now she can put her car up in the garage for the first time. Yay. How's it feel putting oh. her in the garage for the first time? This is the first time we had a car in the garage. Second. When well, we were first, first here, I had parked in here. No, you didn't. But then we started moving in. Oh, yeah, you did one time. Yeah. Second time. Oh, this is great. Now you just walk outside, get in here, and get out. Can you tell we're first time homeowners? We're excited <laughs> about putting a car in the garage. Oh, great. Now we're going to finish off today going to Costco, and we'll show you how we take our trash out because. Uh, when we moved out here, obviously, well, maybe it's not obvious, but our driveway is very long, so yeah. we don't always walk it to the, the curb. No. Yeah, we got a lot in here. Him and these booties on his feet. I cannot. So you just hitch it to the back. Sometimes when I do it, it falls off. And that is the worst. It's tragic. But yeah, this the long old driveway. Ain't nobody walking this trash all the way up here. Usually I take this, like our trash come Thursday mornings. But usually I gotta work early on Thursdays. So I gotta leave the house by like 4.30, 5 o'clock around then. This trash is extra loud when I be driving it. But the neighbors probably don't like Thursday mornings. I was about to say, maybe they don't. <laughs> Plug's house. She's the key to the margaritas. <laughs> and the food. And the food. Look at her getting it out of the oven right now. <laughs> this is authentic. Homemade bone broth. Bone broth. Yeah, we finna be ready for the weekend. Yep. Oh. We made it to Costco with Gerald and Mom. Yes, here for the margarita mix and a few other things. Why are shopping with women like this? You come for one thing and then you end up looking at 10,000 other things. So I'm here for the margarita. I mean, look. Like, do this look like a margarita mix? No. Not at all. They're on to me. <laughs> well, now we're looking for something halfway applicable. Looking for snow pants. Yeah, these are might be okay. <laughs> they not. These big old Yeah, things. that's how you tell you. Nope, not gonna work. The shot. Oh, oh that's what you said. Finally made it. We're looking for the margarita mix now. Thank goodness. Where's that? Oh, great. Putting y'all on real quick. Mmm, this ain't it. Mm -mm. No, it ain't. No. No. They trying to tell me that it's the right one. I know what I'm here for, but we're gonna try it out anyway. Well, the mission was 
50% successful. Didn't get the exact one I was looking for, but you know, that's usually how you be finding the new stuff and get put on to things. This one might end up being better than the one that I like. I mean, it's basically the other one, but it got triple second into it. Ah, almost dropped it. So I guess we'll check it out. We'll see what it's talking about. I'm ready to get out of here. So it is the next day, the day the storm is supposed to hit. And right now it's raining a good amount. And it's supposed to just keep raining until it keeps getting colder and colder. That rain will turn to snow. And then that freeze going to hit. It's 4 o'clock right now. And by 4 in the morning, the temperature is supposed to be at negative 6 degrees. It's 36 degrees right now. So all this rain, all this is just going to freeze dumb hard. So it's going to get real testy. So what I think we're going to go ahead and do right now before it gets too cold and all this rain freezes is put some salt down just on the walkways. This pathway here up to the door, the porch. And since my truck is going to be outside, I'm probably going to salt you know, onto the driveway as well. So just make sure we don't slip and bust our head or bust our arm or something like that. Uh, <laughs> I don't know about you, but falling in the cold is the worst thing of all time. It hurt 50 times more. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that real quick. All right, all wrapped up with that. So now we just gotta wait for the wife to come home. Maybe we'll have a nice little margarita or something that we were so geeked about yesterday. And then from that point on, we're just gonna sit around and wait for the snow, the ice, and this dang old cold to come. I'm not looking forward to the cold in these wind chills. I'm, I'm really not. Y'all hear how loud this is? That's the trash can. <laughs> That look dumb loud. <laughs> look at that. She did it without dropping it. You flakes some snow are falling. Tragic. Wish it was daytime so I could see. Because you're struggling with the embroidered machine. Oh, not anymore, Gerald. I'm thriving. Watch this. Not anymore, guys. She's thriving. Watch this. <laughs> Finished product. Ignore the little dots. I can't resist not going out there. <laughs> Alright, let's go. Ah! Wow. <laughs> I wish y'all could see out there. We'll see what kind of animals run around out here in the morning. So the type of snow tracks they leave. These windows is so, so you can see straight up in the house. Mira, you looking straight into the crib. Look at her little pea head right there. Whew. All right, that's enough of that. Yeah, I mean, kind of, I didn't make it the same as I usually do just cause it already has some in there. So I didn't put the, what I usually put in there. But yeah, that margarita mix, subpar, not to my standard anyway. She said it tastes pretty much the same, but I don't like pretty much. I want it to taste exactly the same. Pretty much wrap it up for today. Then tomorrow we gonna see what that sled talking about. Maybe it's gonna be dumb cold. I don't think we're gonna be out there too long. And see how everything holds up. See how we make it through our first winter storm, so. Back at it in a second. Yeah. 
is currently 4.30 in the morning and I have to go to work. <laughs> it is negative seven right now. The wind is blowing hard as ever. It is freezing. Look at the snow out here. It's not a lot of snow. It's just more cold and wind. My goodness. Wind gusting like crazy. These winds are nuts, man. One thing that we're worried about is hopefully the house and pipes and stuff don't freeze and that it can hold heat. We have radiant heat here, but we haven't really had a test and it doesn't seem very efficient at all. Sometimes it still gets a little cold even when we have it cranked up. So it's definitely going to be a test to see if we can keep out these neg eight uh temperatures so i'm just going around to every room they're really climate controlled so you can see so i'm going around to every room and cranking the mugs all the way up usually only do a couple rooms at a time like the kitchen the living room and the bedroom but since it's gonna be cold as ever i'm turning all the home on Every last one of them. All right, we about to go on a trip outside real quick. Neck 30 wind chill? Mm -mm. We'll be out there for a few seconds. <laughs> that looks like from the living room. Uh, for like two seconds. Oh, keep going, Not as much snow as I would have hoped. I'm about to slip and bust my head open and I can just feel it. This one. It is freezing. I don't really know where I'm going right now. Woo! <laughs> it's icy. <laughs> Can't wait. I need to snow a little bit more. It'll look cooler when the snow's more. Very nice out though. Ah! Ah! Okay. I hate when snow is real cold outside and it crunches under your feet. Ooh, I hurt the way it feels. I hate the way it sounds. Oh, it drives me nuts. It's pretty cool out here, though. I hope I'm not spinning too fast. Let's do a slow spin. Ooh. Eee. My head all in the way. <laughs> Gosh, oh my hands. All right, that's the end of the tour. I got to get inside. Oh, my hands are free. Woo yeah, I ain't playing around with that no more. That's what it looks like out here. Ah! I'm locked out. <laughs> hey. <sighs> she saved me. Going back out there, I'm risking my life for y'all. Showing y'all the top of the hill. We gonna slid down. Whew, I'm gonna make it quick. Back into the tundra. Mm. All right, watch this time. All right, I'm good. So this is the hill. We gonna slid down. Well, that's where I'm taking y'all right now. Hope y'all can hear me. It's dumb windy. I gotta put my mouth in the phone, they near to talk. Ah! All right, I made it to the hill, we gonna slid down. So all the way down there, you go, I'm up on the top of it, and you go down to there. The house all the way back over there. As you can see, oh, it's so cold, oh my gosh. And this wind is nuts. I hope y'all can hear me. But yeah, that's where we're gonna be at. And I'm finna run back. 
I'm tired from running here. But it's cold. I ain't got no gloves. And my hand holding this stick is freezing, so. Just... Ah! Well, that is the end of this video. We hope you enjoyed us getting prepared for our first winter storm on Promise View. Um, but yeah, if you want, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe, and we'll see you next time. Bye. Peace.